Good day to everyone. I'm Mad Duantamad, and welcome to another video here at Maid Farms. For today's video, we'll show you how we brood our chicks here at Maid Farms. So let us open our chick brooder. Here we have our day-old chicks scratching and playing on the mulch. We use standard auto drinkers and auto feeders and 40 watt incandescent light bulbs to heat our brooder. We use a deep litter method in our brooder which composed of rice straw, rice hull, chicken manure, dried leaves, and kitchen waste in our farm. The deep litter method serves as a thermal mass which absorbs the heat from our light bulb and regulates the temperature inside our brooder. It absorbs the moisture from the manure of the chicks and keeps our litter dry, free from flies and foul odor. Our chicks are healthy because they get to scratch and exercise on the mulch and they like to lie down and absorb the heat from the composting. We can also save on electricity because the composting process will also produce its own heat. Our system is a continuous flow composting system so we don't need to turn our compost every so often. We just allow our chicks to scratch and process our compost by adding moisture and nitrogen through their manure and shredding it through their scratching. The flooring of our coop has holes in it so after the chicks have scratched and turned our compost and shredded it to tiny pieces, it will fall down to the bottom of our coop. So we don't only get healthy chicks from the heat of our compost, we also get high quality soil in the process. This vertical system is ideal for the urban setting where space is limited. By stacking up the process, we just need to put mulch on top and get soil at the bottom. We don't only save space, we can also eliminate foul odor and take care of chickens even in an urban environment where you have neighbors. To get our soil, we simply lift our cover and use a rake to grab the soil from the back to the front. To further process our compost into a usable mix, we use a sieve and mechanically sieve the large particles and use the fine particles in our garden. As you can see, by just providing our chicks with food, water, and a good shelter design, they do all the work for us. We get high quality compost with the perfect ratio of carbon and nitrogen. We no longer need diesel powered shredders and petroleum based fertilizers for our farm. This high quality compost is now ready to be used in our farms and in our gardens.
So there you have it, rooting our chicks here at Wade Farms. Again, thank you for watching our videos. To learn more about how we make farming easy here at Made Farms, subscribe to my YouTube channel, Madonna, or add us on Facebook, Modular Aquaponics. See you in the next videos. I'm trying to farm here. <laughs>